trumped moral politics. In the shamanic world, a world we are addressing with the idea of a quantum life, we see everything as energy. There is, quote, negative energy, end quote, the energy of the destructive death and decay of fermentation and marination. And then there is the, quote, positive energy, the energy of creative, life-giving, growing, flowering. Both of these energies create the yin and yang of the physical world that we perceive through our senses. There would not be one without the other. Hence, ultimately, the division of energies into positive and negative, making one good and the other bad, is an arbitrary judgment having nothing to do with the truth of reality. With all the controversy and chaos making surrounding the election of a new U.S. president, it's important to embrace this everything-is-energy truism. I've personally never agreed with the two-party system in the United States. At its core, it's divisive and serves to divide into two camps populations whose beliefs run the full spectrum of human emotions, values, and morals, hardly contained within two platforms of political belief. However, to divide is to control... A divided electorate is a controllable one, and those in power have used this divide-and-conquer strategy since the dawn of time. This is why I was not at all surprised at the rise of and the election of our current president. The further the pendulum swung in one direction, it was surely going to swing in the other. It's the nature of the two-party system. And when it comes to liberal versus conservative, it's interesting to note how these concepts have evolved through the years. I remember back in the day when liberal represented more along the lines of hippies and free thinkers, where conservatives were more about keeping a comfortable status quo and being frugal with money. <laughs> Nowadays, liberal has come to be embraced as humanitarian by liberals, and conservatives have come to be known as self-empowered by conservatives. Yet the liberals define conservative self-empowerment as self-serving, and the conservatives see liberal humanitarianism as socialism. How petty and unserving are both views, because they trap a certain moral code into an oversimplified cage of judgment and denial. That said, our current president has come into power not as a liberal or a conservative, but as a disruptor a joker card, if you will, bringing chaos and outrageous uncertainty to a political world that has been hypnotized to sleep in a gigantic inhuman monolith known as the government, and it's all driven by the engine of finance. Believe it or not, one time in this country's history, the people came first and the money came second. This has, over time, been reverted because money is power in this culture. We also must remember that the word, quote, democracy, was shunned by the founding fathers who saw fit not to use it in the Constitution. As Thomas Jefferson famously stated, quote, a democracy is nothing more than mob rule, where 51% of the people may take away the rights of the other 49, end quote. And as the years rolled by, the building up of polarized quantum entanglements of politics within the supposed democracy have at last culminated in a completely polarized electorate, unable to hear or even allow opinions of the other side. And then, amidst all this extreme rancor, sits the disruptor of a president. It couldn't get more dramatic, and yet this grand entanglement is revealing the true mechanisms behind the status quo established long ago by power-seeking men and women who have lost the point of what it means to have a functioning republic. Out of chaos rises awareness and unheard-of possibilities. This is America's greatest hope, to unite in the awareness of who the controllers really are and recreate a better world without them. Again, everything is energy, and as individual creators, how we create the energy of our own lives is how a better world for all is achieved. 
You have been listening to This Quantum Life by Boyd Martin. Brought to you by the Quantum Health Newsletter from Pure Energy Rx. www.pureenergyrx.com.